Okay, uh, we're gonna show you how to make tom yum soup, which is one of the uh, favorites in uh, Thai soup, I guess. Uh, the other one is probably tom kha gai, or most people would know it by chicken coconut soup. This is actually pretty easy, and it only has a few ingredients. Um, the most important one is the lemongrass, right here. Uh, and we also have the wangal, right here. Mm -hmm. um, we have the kaffir lime leaf, and we have the mushrooms. And we're gonna put shrimp in here, but it's in the refrigerator right now. So I'm gonna prep this and go get a shrimp, and we'll get it cooking. All right, so this is the lemongrass, and you're getting ready to yep. prep it. So yep, uh, the way you do, the way I do it is I use the back of the knife, and I kind of crack it a little bit to release the flavor. Okay. So that when it hits the, the water, uh, it releases all the oil. Okay. And then what you do is you cut it about uh, an inch and a half. Like so. Okay. Just don't cut your finger. What do you do if you have extra lemongrass? Is there any way to keep it or is it like... It's actually, you can freeze it sometimes, but uh, don't keep it in there for too long. How long is too long? Um, I say a month. Green onions. Okay. And we're gonna use this to just put on top of the soup once the soup is done. Okay. For garnish. All you have to do is cut the root off. And I say cut it. Just about as half an inch diagonally. That's it. All right, so I'm making tom yum soup. First thing you do is to uh, use the cut up lemongrass. Just throw it in this the uh, hot water, or almost hot. And the galong goes, goes in there also, like so. And let it boil for about 10 minutes to release all the fragrance and the flavor into the broth. Now we're gonna put some tamarind in there, just a couple of teaspoons. So next is the roasted chili paste. Put like a teaspoon and a half in there. And I'm just gonna stir it up a little bit. Some sugar. Some fish sauce. I'm gonna taste it a little bit just to see how it tastes right now. I need a little bit more of the fish sauce in there. Also a little bit more sugar. And now we're gonna add some sliced uh, button mushrooms in there. I say, you know, a box that you can get in the grocery store. Pour that in there. The last thing that would go in here is the trim because that takes no time for the cooking. And now we're going to add some tomatoes. Uh, These are cherry tomatoes in there. And we're going to stir it up. I'm going to 
bring it to the boil and get ready to put the shrimp in there. And now we're going to put some lime leaves in there. Try to break them up a little bit so it releases the flavor. Alright, so now we're going to put some lime juice in here. The trick to this is to use a metal spoon and that would help you get all the juice out. Now I'm going to add a little bit of the chili oil for color. Alright, so this is almost the last step. We're going to put shrimp in here. Uh, wait till the water is boil again. And we're just going to put shrimp in there. Um, you're going to stir a little bit. And what you do is you actually turn the heat off. And the trick to that is shrimp doesn't need a lot of time to cook. And this will be perfectly cooked in about two minutes. And the soup is ready. Okay, the last step is to just put some garnish in there. And it's uh, cilantro. And some of the uh, green onions that we cut earlier, if you remember. <laughs> just throw it in there and we're done.